In this video, I'll show you how to set up a dual monitor wallpaper to span across both of your monitors. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. And please do make sure you watch this video right until the end of so the four steps. And without any further ado, let's go and jump into this guide. Here we are on my desktop. And as you can see at the moment, I've just got the default Windows wallpaper, but we're gonna go and get one wallpaper, which is gonna span over both of my monitors. And it's gonna look really, really cool. The first thing you want to do is just come onto your desktop and go and right click. And as you can see, we go and get this list here and you want to go and click on display settings just here. And it's gonna take you to load and here we are. So I'm gonna go and zoom in and all you want to do is go and click on one of your monitors. As you can see, I've gone and got two different monitors here. I'm clicking on number two for now. And then you want to go and scroll down and you want to go and locate the display resolution. And as you can see, my monitor is 2560 by 1440. So the number you want to note down is this first one here. So I've got 2560. So I'm just gonna go and put this in my calculator. And then you want to come back up here and go and select your other monitor as well. So I'm gonna select my number one monitor and then scroll down once again, and this is 1920. So then I'm gonna go and type in 1920. So most people's monitors are probably 1920, um, but yours may be different, but you just wanna make sure you go and get the right result. So mine is 4480. Now all you want to do is go and open up a search engine. So I'm personally using Google Chrome, but you can use whatever you like. And what we're gonna do is gonna go and search a wallpaper with this resolution. In my case, it's 4480. Yours is probably gonna be different. So what you want to do is go and search wallpaper and then the resolution. So mine is 4480 and I'm gonna go and press enter and there we go. So here we go, I'm now gonna click on images and as you can see, there are so many to choose from and you want to go and click on them, then hover your mouse on the image and it's gonna go and give you the actual resolution as some of these may be a little bit different and you just want to make sure they're right. So as you can see, this is 4480. So this image is going to work and here is another one as well. That looks really cool and there are loads of awesome ones here. But for now, I think I'm gonna go for this one here. So then all you want to do is go and right click on it and you want to go and click save image as and you're going to go and get your file explorer pop up. So go and save it somewhere easy to find. In my case, that's going to be the downloads folder. So I'm going to go and click on save and there we go. It then goes and downloads and um, that's going to depend on your browser. And then for now, we can come and close off of Google Chrome as well. Then all you want to do is close off the display settings just like this and we can close off the calculator as well. And all you want to do is right click and then go click personalize just like so. And here we are in our background settings. And then all you want to do is come under choose your picture and you want to go and click on browse and wait for it to load. Then you want to go and find the image you just downloaded. So mine is this top one here and you want to go and click choose picture. Then it's gonna take a moment to load and here we go. So as you probably noticed, it's actually just using the same image and putting it on both monitors, just like it usually would. But to go and change this, all you want to do is come down here under choose a fit and you want to go and click on fill and you want to go and make sure it's gone and set on span. So click on span and then it's gonna go and do exactly what we said we're gonna do. And it's now going across both monitors and that looks really, really cool. And I'm just gonna go and put a quick video clip on my phone on top of the video right now. So there we go, guys. That is how you can go and span your wallpaper over to monitors if you found this video useful please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel leave a like for more peace